It's uh, it's pretty early. Ernie's on his way over. I have the camera very close to the door so that he just runs right into it. Oh, I have to, I have to PayPal this kid. Someone sent me this for retail because they copped it. I don't necessarily even need it or anything, but I copped it anyway, but I haven't paid him yet. I gotta find his PayPal. These are embroidered and stretch vinyl. Nice move, Ronnie. Nice move. Ruined my whole plan. What? I was just gonna have that there. I was gonna have you walk it all crazy and run into it. Oh. Have it knock over. Oh, I could have. I know, but I didn't want. You changed your mind? No, I literally just walked away and stopped hitting record. You showed up at perfect time. Oh, here now. My first trap. I'm ready. <laughs> my first trap for the day. Oh, God. Yes. Good man. Oh. I don't even work, does it? No, this is mine. I bought another one. The guy didn't know me that day. Why are you yelling? I'm, at I'm, me. I'm wild. I We're raving together. together Big breath. If we blow our smoke into each other, baby. Right? <laughs> and their vape stuff really does taste good, though. This is UK cheese. It sounds like an ad. Why does everything sound like an ad to you? I don't know. What? Boom, 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 boom. What do you think? There's a biker next to you, too. You see? Biker will get clipped. Oh, shit. I ain't worried about them. I don't, don't share no road. No. I ain't about sharing. Who's sharing, motherfucker? Bike. I don't even know what that means. Bike this way. That like, means what? it's a fucking bike lane. The guy can just fucking get right there. In front yes, of my car. it means that the bike. There's no bike lane here, so that they need to uh, heed by the traffic. Like they need to get in traffic. That's what it means. <laughs> Until they get on the sidewalk. But they're not no, you're not allowed sidewalk. to be on the sidewalk. They're in traffic. It's a vehicle. That's why you can get a DUI on a bicycle, dog. That's what I'm going for this summer. GT Mustang. Hey now, hey now. I got a GT Mustang. I've been dropping some straight hits on the block lately. You gotta put them all out. Yeah. You're just leaking a little bit from each mm -hmm. one. Then. It's a new way of marketing. The leak is in the blog. Oh shit. We got a situation over here. Come on. Hey, fuck face, come on. Try to get to the fucking dog park. Hey, you fucks. Now this guy's just going, he changed his mind. Hey, now you wanna go, you wanna stop? What do you wanna do? What is wow. this? Wow. Wow, Jesus This dude made signs. Family. Sign that says he is an angel. Do you wanna just take the camera and go interview him? I, I will. You won't. I mean, we could just pay him. I guess. You don't even have to pay him. My man would Jesus. love to spread his message. I'm just saying. I mean, my man is, if my man is like, he's an angel. In one mile. What if we drove back by and we're like, hey, can we interview you for our video? Since you're an angel that came from heaven. Yeah, I have a Boo Scott shirt on. I'll tell him that I'm, I'm a man of God. Give him 20 bucks, 40 bucks, whatever. <laughs> Are you ready? Look, you're all nervous. The thing is, if we did this and I was on foot on 16th Street, or we do this, I'll walk up to people, but to, to park and then have to, I start thinking too much into it, and I'm like, I don't know. What, what if I do all this and this guy's like, get the fuck out of here. But, well, you could just drive by and roll your window down. Hey, you, you want stuff. a fucking interview? Excuse me, Boost God. Uh, I see that you're an angel that fell from heaven on your sign. Could we please talk? My camera, I would really like to hear what you have to say. Yeah. I mean, my man made 40 signs going down the street. It's obvious he once got something to say, right? I think you should do it. I think you should bust a U and go do it. I think you're afraid. I think this is amazing. Because either way, it's amazing. Oh, God. You love U-turns. This may be the U-turn that changes your life forever. I don't even know <laughs> what I'm going to ask this guy. Um, He has signs that say he's an angel that fell to earth from heaven. I think there's probably a good icebreaker there. All right, let's see what the parking situation looks like. How pretty <laughs> fucking hot. Dude, then I'm like, am I making fun of this guy who's out of his fucking I mind? I legitimately want to know what the fuck he... Right. You're not making fun of him. I want to know what he's talking about. If it's fucking crazy and it's like weird, I'm not going to edit it into the vlog. It's like, oh, that was fucked up, man. That dude's fucked up. Like, obviously, I'm, yeah. not gonna, I'm gonna be like, yeah, this is fucked up. I'm not fucking Logan Paul. If I pull up and I'm seeing him and there's like a lot like I was going to have the just... interview of my life, but the parking situation was just fucked. So, butt crack just straight hanging out. Yeah. Bato style though with the socks. Yeah. Got the ill New Balance socks <laughs> with the fucking Bojack and trainers on. <laughs> Killing it. 
camera's making him uneasy. Yeah, it is. He's pacing very aggressively. It's definitely a prison pace. This whole block is Fortnite. Look, we got characters on every block. Every fucking block. Real shit, though. Do you know why you see him out here so early? Like, because it's earlier than we're normally out? Okay. It's because their fucking high is worn off from the night before. Okay, you know, you make your $7 or whatever to get a bundle of heroin. And you fucking go get your fix and then you're done. It's like, you know, as long as you cover your nut every month, <laughs> but every day. They, so they're out here early as fuck getting that money before they start getting dope sick. God, I can go left. Oh too, God, yeah, but you probably should have waited for a green arrow. Oh, right. Where? How to the live fuck? forever. Jesus lived and looked of a YouTube. This says YouTube. Jesus is black. Don't no. save money. Give to the poor. Does Jesus it say is YouTube? Black. Jesus yes, is it black. does. Jesus hates families. That's right. what that one thing I says. Gotta... Oh, it says YouTube. You gotta talk to him. I, I am trying. I, I mean, do you want to sit here? Yeah. Like, is somebody gonna ask you to move? I don't know. It says no parking at any time. <laughs> probably so. Yeah. I... Yes. You're so nervous. All right, let's just go to the dog park. Let's go to the dog park. On the way back, I'm going to agree with him that Jesus is black. If you want to be a five percenter, you've got to you've got to at least be able to admit that mm. as a white person. I read that in the book. You want some fucking Vinnie Paz shit right now, huh? <laughs> no, but... <laughs> 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 yeah, I mean, I guess that, yeah, that's what I'm talking about, but... Now everybody's going to think I'm a pussy. Just block traffic, too. You know what I mean? Just pull up in the just lane pull right and pull out. out. Yeah, like, yo. Yo. Oh, we're out here. Right. Talk, being out here early sucks. There's shit. People are everywhere. The Denver Athletic Club. Hey, I'll be there in a little bit. Yep. Be there in a little bit. We'll be there. Pumping some fucking iron. Hey, move a little weight around, why don't you? Nothing, nothing like old Buff Bagwell over here. Look at that guy. He's no, I'm talking about you. I'm glad you're checking out the security guard. You think he's buff? No, he's a cop. <laughs> Is he a cop? He's full bum. Ooh, he does have a full bum cop stance. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, look at that. He's taking shit pretty seriously. Yeah, you don't work out like that. Goddamn cell phone. Uh, hold on now. Uh, Tom, I told you, you're breaking my cover. Wearing the desert boots. Yeah, he's got the gun right out of sight. He's wearing a fucking bulletproof vest. He's not buff. Oh. What are you talking about? Got a YouTube channel just seeing what's going on. I don't know if you want to get all the signs or not, but um, this is this is my name and how like a lot of scriptures and history and mythology relates to who I am. Oh, you're handing these out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, thank you. Cool, man. Well, look at it. What's your name? Thank you, bro. Yeah, we saw the signs. Thank you very much. We, we want people, it's time, I believe it's time for us to go home and do faith. We all have the same faith in who we are. We, we, we're more than humans. We're fallen angels. It's time to go home. I like that. Yeah, I mean, yo, dude, that's the thing that, like, it almost hurts you inside. Like, I'm like, my man is literally standing here on the sidewalk. He might be right, though. He's the dude that in the movie, he gets taken up first, and he's like, told you so. gonna turn it on big. This dude's cooking Blue Apron and they're making cheese pizzas. And they... <laughs> yeah. He doesn't even need a knife for any of this yeah. shit. <laughs> that knife's made to cut through bone this <laughs> thick. <laughs> this motherfucker is opening a pop tart with it. Yeah, let's just go home. All right. Shoot some shoes. Maybe the whites have arrived. That's not <laughs> That's not a pretty racist. <laughs> the whites have arrived. <laughs> Don't put that in the box. It's really weird. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's pretty amazing. Okay, we're going, we're going. Really an ultimate a draw on when you bought a knife set, because I know probability-wise that you'll cut yourself. Uh, that's what I, that's the first thing that goes through my mind is like, man, if I hit my finger with that, it's not going to be like the other knife. No, well, you know what? I'm going to cook dinner for everyone in my house. How about that? No. Turn left onto 20. The Happy Shack, is this a hand job spot? <laughs> I think it's a smoke shop. Oh, <laughs> Unless gosh. you want that guy to give you a hand job in there. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh shit. This is here. Yeah. 
Get off my box, sir. That's not for you. Can you use your knife to open it? No. no. You can really see the difference in the knit pattern in this one. Oh, the yeah. Toe to I didn't even realize that in the other one. I mean, I talked about it on the vlog. No. You watched the vlog. I, yes, I'm saying when I visually first saw it, I didn't realize it. Oh, yeah. These are the fire ones. These look so fucking different in person than they look on the internet. Bruh. These are fire. Woo! Wow. Fun! All sleepers. All sleepers. That is dope. I know. I don't give a fuck. That's really dope to me. Because it's almost burgundy. Yeah. See pictures of something that's not what you're used to seeing. Yeah. Everybody wants their fucking socks to be blown off all the time. No yeah. pun intended. But then if they change anything, they don't. Most people don't check it out. I'm glad I went back and checked them out. And they dropped the black there, and I'm glad that most of them are on sale. Take it. Go ahead then. So tough. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, dog. Ooh. Cop me another knife. So I'm gonna go cut up a tomato for lunch or something. <laughs> nice. Have fun with that. I'm gonna go to the gym. Omar's tuckered. Uh, I'm headed out. It's like two o'clock. It's Gotham outside. I'm headed to the gym and then I'll be back. Salad. Emails. I think my uh, undefeated whites are downstairs. So. Shoes. The undefeated. I didn't catch that good enough. Undefeated, ultra boost, and blood. So this shoe has a lot of talk. There's a lot of hate, a lot of talk, a lot of speculation, a lot of rumors, a lot of chit chat, a lot of static, you know? Just a lot, a, lot of, a lot of things. It says undefeated across in stretch vinyl. So it is a black ultra boost, plastic DPU cages, black laces, an undefeated insole, uh, white boost, white continental sole with a Black torsion system, vinyl lettering that says undefeated, undefeated branding, second half of the word undefeated, and then performance logo branding. The major differences in this shoe. So the big question or debate or argument, whatever, what have you, is whether or not this is a 1.0 Ultra Boost or if it is something different. Is it a 4.0? Is it this? Is it that? It's definitely a 1.0 Ultra Boost in the toe box. It is absolutely a 1.0 Ultra Boost pattern. The back heel goes into a mesh like a 1.0, but there are differences. There's not things that you've seen before on a 1.0 Ultra Boost. This collaboration has added Added a toe guard to the front. I don't think there's a 1.0 with a toe guard in the front. Is there anything with ATR on the front? I don't think there is. 2.0. This is the first time an Ultra Boost has ever had a neoprene sock collar. So this is all neoprene on the outside. It doesn't go into PK anymore. 1.0s went into mesh and then the rest of them went into PK. The major difference with this shoe is the openness of the holes in the shoe. That toe box is much more dramatic than any other Ultra Boost. It's pretty similar in uh, size to the regular black 1.0, but it is bigger, the pores are larger. I wear white socks with shoes like this so that you can see. It is very similar to the 1.0 openness of the Chinese New Year. Uh, this would be the only other Ultra Boost that I can remember that has that open toe pattern where it's just more open like that. Uh, so this one has been opened up as well, but there's also, it seems like there's a coating on top. I don't know if it's like a water resistant coating. Some of the knit in there just seems like it has like a sheen to it. It's definitely not 3M. I don't know if it's because of the openness, it's supposed to help whisk away water and moisture if you run through a puddle I have no idea but it definitely looks like there's a coating on the knit itself especially in the front uh, as far as fit goes they fit just like any other 1.0 really I wouldn't expect any other kind of fit out of it it feels very very similar to 1.0 to me some people were reporting that it was stretchier some people were reporting it was a lot like Climacool it doesn't have that same feel to me it definitely has more of a 1.0 vibe to it. There's just a couple of little upgrades, you know, like the neoprene, the openness. And the letters, you know, at first I called this a lazy collab and, you know, looking at the whole scope of the entire collab, the, the idea behind the collab was to bring an urban edge to performance wear. So I think that the openness of it is to make it just more breathable. Just like the Adi Zeros we looked at yesterday, everything's really breathable in this whole collab. And all of the clothing seems really uh, movement oriented and it's definitely all designed for performance. So I think this Ultra Boost just has a couple of extra performance features. Kept it simple, they did what they did. I know a lot of people don't like it because people expect just 
more and more out of collabs and I get it. At first I wasn't really into this shoe and I still, it's just, it's another black ultra boost but I did find myself looking at the mirror and liking the lettering going across just the way it looks on feet. And I really like that you can't really read it. I like that you really don't know what this says unless you really know what you're looking for. You know, like no, nobody's mom knows what this says. I kept asking myself today if they dropped an Ultra Boost that just said Adidas across it if I would cop. And I think the answer is probably yes. Especially if it was on more of a 1.0 style. It's definitely the first 1.0 that we've gotten in a while other than like a climb a cool look. Which brings me to the other pair. So the other pair just got here. Uh, I had to run downstairs and uh, this one. This one is definitely 4.0. The knit's not even as open. Well, even the back doesn't even go in. Yeah, it's PK, it's 4.0 all the way. So same exact um, features, the neoprene sock collar. It's all the same except they used a 4.0 upper on the undefeated only, which is an interesting move. The whole thing is super interesting and confusing in that regard. But the white ones are here too. I didn't have time to really shoot these, but it's, you know, I think you'll get the idea. These are what both of these look like. But yeah, that's the difference. You can definitely see those vertical lines in the 4.0. Yeah, and the white fits completely different, like a 4.0. So they're different shoes completely. So you got the undefeated 1.0 hybrid openness ATR. Undefeated 4.0 exclusive with black laces. This one came with extra laces too. I just don't know which ones, where they are, whatever. I don't know. Uh, tomorrow is exciting. Tomorrow's 4.20, so got some stuff planned. All right. Peace.